the doorways open up and see What kind of lifeline will be waiting there for me I need to bury all these fears And let them fade away I'm not scared, I'm prepared To find myself Hey everybody, so today I am going to talk about April Alana McCalson. This one has a couple of pictures of her, but I'm going to share this one with you guys so you can see a few more pictures. Make it bigger for you. Okay. So, April went missing on April 6, 2012, from Tulsa, Oklahoma. She's considered endangered missing, female, white, 47 years old when she went missing. She's about 5'5 five five to 5'10, five 140 to 155 pounds. April suffers from bipolar disorder and isn't taking the medication she needs to control her condition. April was last seen in Tulsa, Oklahoma on April 6, 2012. She spoke to her father on the phone and said there were people bothering her. She was transient lifestyle at the time of her disappearance, moving from house to house and staying with friends. And her father didn't know where she was living. She never got in touch with her family and her whereabouts are unknown. The man whose house April was staying in when she went missing committed suicide before the police were able to interview him. It's unclear whether his death is related to her case. After she was last heard from, someone tried to use her bank card once a Tulsa, once at a Tulsa business, but authorities weren't able to determine whether the person was McCallson. So, several months after she vanished, a jogger found April's bank card on a trail at La Fortune Park. April is very athletic and was known as a frequent jogger in the River Parks area of Tulsa. She has dropped out of sight before, making spontaneous trips to places as far as Texas, Georgia, and the United Kingdom, but she's never been gone for this long, and she always left a paper trail by using her bank card and credit cards. Because of the circumstances of her disappearance, her family fears for her safety. Her case remains unsolved. And... The case has been updated last December 17th, 2023, and that's when her middle name was added. So on the Charlie Project, they have a lot of pictures here. So she has a lot of different um, hairstyles in these pictures. That's why I wanted to show you. And she went all the way up to the United Kingdom. So she could be anywhere in this world, to be honest. So this is why I wanted to cover this story because she could have traveled anywhere and she could be anywhere if she wanted to flee or whatnot, if that's the case. And she's been missing for 12 years now. 
So if we could get her name back out there by, you know, hitting the like button, commenting below, that always helps to keep these videos in the YouTube algorithm. I do thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you guys again soon. Bye, guys. Love you all. Sending you love and light.